All right, so March 7, cereal is celebrated and eaten today. Now, cereal in general may be a name for any grain such as wheat, barley, oat, or corn. Cereal has usually, um, cereal has usually been meant for breakfast, but cereal now is very popular, especially in our country. So, um, and it gained popularity at times when they started looking for healthier options. Now, um, until 1860, now listen to this, mm -hmm. breakfast was dominated by eggs, bacon, and sausages. Reformers began preaching that eating too much meat was both physically, spiritually harmful. Now, mm. So they started looking at cereal as an, an option. option. So what cereal did you have this morning? Well, I, I, <laughs> I didn't have any cereal. But I think, I know I, su I su kind of support that because you see, even as people are moving to healthier options, they're doing a lot of cereal. So you see things like granola, you're eating like bran for the high fiber quality. And we're tilting towards that. Even people that used to do pap, you know, anakara, they're now also looking they're coming back to their papa <laughs> it's so interesting because um because of my health care last week so i started making sure that i eat so i bought i i um, i had had this um there's a local cereal that we have local grain it's called acha and it's very it's one of the healthiest meal mm -hmm. and you could you can prepare it in all forms so if you can prepare it as a uh, pudding so for breakfast or you can prepare it as like jollof to eat it like lunch yes acha it's Acha. tiny. The grains are really tiny, but it's amazing. So that's what I've been now, having. Now with weight loss. That's what that's where we're going. <laughs> okay. You know, especially now that let me not announce it on TV, but I'm thinking to go in the vegan. <laughs> They've joined me to one group. Why you cannot I be can't a cope. vegan? Your love for meat. <laughs> <laughs> it's I too much. Go. You can't. You can't. Don't I can't abandon go. it. But you I'm can't. trying. I've I've gone five days without it. So hopefully. how are you feeling? Are you okay? I'm actually feeling very good. You know, it's just that now I'm missing it and all that. So I think cereal is a very good option. It is. You know, I mean, I for for be breakfast, all this English breakfast is too complicated. Is you it? have to do baked beans, bacon, uh, but, we, but we're having so many breakfast rooms and tea rooms. It's these too days. much. It's too much. <laughs> All right, so okay, what did you find for us in the news today? Okay, so in the news today, my news will be taken from Sahara Reporters. Now, recall that two days ago, or thereabouts, we had this scare that there are three new cases. So we had three new people that were, that travelers that got in and they were suspected of um, being infected with coronavirus. Oh, okay. And it was really panic for everyone. But I am so happy to take this news today that it had been confirmed negative, so the test came back negative. And it was um, the Lagos State Commissioner for Health, Professor Aki Abayomi, that said that, you know, these people are free, no coronavirus have been discharged. So we still have one case. No, we've not got into four. I'm very happy about that, you know. That's fantastic. Because that was really scary if we now had three new <sighs> cases. You know, I was watching a funny video that Plus TV put up on Instagram today. <laughs> I laughed. Like, the, the guy, he, he wasn't speaking, um, no, uh, like, he was speaking the local, um, sorry, the pidgin English. And he was saying, Corona cannot survive in Nigeria. Okay. That's, that Nigeria... <laughs> That no, if, we if love God, us. No, but we love ourselves. Like, we but the guy was. Ourselves. This is like a, they just did a poll on the street, okay. and the guy they were interviewing the guy. Okay. The guy said he can also that the depression in Nigeria. <laughs> when, <laughs> we kill it. That Nigeria has so many yeah. problems, and it's so interesting that this is this is the view of a lot of people. Like, he can also survive. He says when you trek, he mentioned <laughs> a place maybe from Mombalende to one place like that. That Corona will be in your body. That before you get to your destination, uh, the me. Corona is. <laughs> I, I, I just we love we love ourselves. Just when when this broke out, within how many hours we ran out of sanitizers? People are ready to even bathe sanitizers for us to be free of this. <laughs> So I'm very happy. We're very prepared. Very, very prepared. So my story is actually, I have like two stories I want to take today. Okay. Uh, since we're, we're just the both of us rolling. So Feel one free. is um, the hospital. I got that from Sky News. The hospital in China that was housing um, some um, people that are under quarantine, uh, it collapsed. I'm sorry, the hotel, not the wow. hospital. Yeah, the hotel collapsed. Wow. And yeah, trapping about 70 people in that building. You know, so so people are doing some conspiracy. Are you sure that? Uh, ooh, uh, that's <laughs> you know, taking it too far. You know, but that, that's that's really that. that's really scary. You know, because especially with and you know rescue, so it means that even whoever that is going to that site to take off the rubble, see, they have to be properly, 
kitted as well because of you know because you're not, you're not to, sure not yeah, the you're not sure if these people because they are already under not. quarantine yeah so now again with on top of quarantine you now have a, a building collapse it doesn't make sense then what really scared me now this is what scared me uk confirmed what's it called new cases of coronavirus wow. yep new cases of coronavirus and they're saying that in in the short space of 24 hours this is the highest that they have um, they, that they've recorded as the the newly infected people wow. i think about 40 people wow. newly infected That's people new yes high. it's a new high for and you know why it's scary for me uk is just like very very close but, but it, but and it, nigerians it, literally they go on friday to the uk and, and come they come back, back on on, on sunday but so, the, the the disease has really been spreading in europe so um if you look at um, France, for yeah. example, it's really been spreading. And also, I think another worst hit country is Iraq. I, yeah, Iran. Iran, Iran actually, yes, Iran. Iran. And it's, the death toll is rising every day. The infection is spreading every day. So it's really, really scary. So That's, UK now, they have a total of 2,206 um, people. So you, you know. see why people were seeing and, you know, still doubting. You know, Nigeria, you've recorded this one case. Are you telling us that it is just this one case? You know, you see how people are doubting it, but I believe that uh, we know what we're doing and we're prepared for it, so it's okay. No, maybe that conspiracy um, theory about. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't make me laugh. I'm no, not, maybe I'm maybe the to. conspiracy conspiracy uh, theory about uh, what's it called now. Um, the black man blood is that? No, yeah, that? the black man blood is there. <laughs> black man blood conspiracy blood. theory about the weather. Okay. You know, maybe. Yeah. It's been coming, but it's just been dying a natural death, you know. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's whatever possible. it is, whatever it is, I'm mm. just very happy that we have it contained and it's not spreading. Mm. So, um, let's take a quick break. We'll be right back. <laughs> 